Patriots and Rams supporters and even just the casual football fan are looking for a piece of the big game memorabilia really hot right now. Unfortunately, some people are looking for ways to take advantage of that. So we go to Fox 5's Angelique Proctor, who joins us now. And Angelique, authorities have issued a warning and they've already seized some counterfeit merchandise, right? They have absolutely issued a warning. A lot of excitement in the air, but the crooks are here too. I got to tell you, this hat that I'm wearing, you know how I love the Falcons, it's counterfeit. So is everything that you see on this table, including this Saints hat. You can see here the top gold button already gone. And this Tom Brady jersey, well, it takes a little more detail here inside. The stitching is a little bit off, and you got paper here under the numbers. All of this stuff is stuff you should not buy. Now, take a look at it. It looks uh, legitimate upon first glance. They say these phony hats, jerseys, and T-shirts that you see here have all been seized in Atlanta this week. Now, where are the stores, you're wondering? Well, they tell me they're all over, including Buckhead and Old National Highway. They say they're also pop-up stores, as well as folks pulling merchandise out of their trunk. And and another huge problem, counterfeit tickets. The devil is always in the details. Make no mistake, though, uh, counterfeit goods are not a victimless crime. The illicit proceeds resulting from their sale are funneled back to support a broad range of crimes. The manufacture and sale of counterfeit goods is a predatory practice that endangers the public health, our economy, and restricts the competitiveness of U.S. products. And it takes advantage of you, the individuals, the fans. The FBI tells us 13 people have been arrested as part of this nationwide NFL investigation. One of those arrested this week in Gwinnett County. The FBI and Homeland Security say they are still out there, as well as the crooks. They say they will continue to confiscate this merchandise and make arrest. Reporting live from downtown, Angelique Proctor, Fox 5 News. All right, got to look for those details. Thank you. Meanwhile, Super Bowl 